Russia claims Georgian forces are involved in ethnic cleansing in a breakaway province, but Georgia claims Russia's guilty of aggression. Meanwhile, the U.S. wants both sides to lay down their arms. More from Fox Radio News reporter Chris Barnes in Washington. A State Department official saying priority one is a ceasefire, and he won't discuss how this is affecting relations with either country. But it's clear the U.S. is most displeased with Russia. That official saying, quote, they're still dropping bombs and we want them to stop. And the president said earlier, I express my grave concern about the uh, disproportionate response of Russia and that um, we strongly condemn uh, you know, bombing outside of South Ossetia. Secretary of State Rice speaking with counterparts of the G7 nations earlier today, all of them calling for ceasefire. In Washington, Chris Barnes, Fox News Radio. Civilians in the South Ossetia region of Georgia are in need of assistance because of the fighting between Russia and Georgian troops. Fox Radio reporter Kate Alexander is in Geneva. The UN Refugee Agency has released two million dollars from its emergency fund to fly essential non-food items to the stricken area. Spokesman Andre Mahetic says the conditions under which people are living in both Georgia and Russia are difficult and dire. The two relief flights will carry humanitarian supplies for up to 30,000 people. They include thousands of blankets, jerry cans and kitchen sets. In Geneva, Kate Alexander, Fox News Radio. A White House wannabe weighing in on the situation in Georgia. Here's Fox reporter Carl Cameron. Republican presidential candidate John McCain began his day in Erie, Pennsylvania at a GE plant that's created 500 new jobs building hybrid diesel electric locomotives that increase fuel efficiency 5% and reduce emissions 40%. McCain also weighed in yet again on the conflict between Russia and the Georgia Republic, saying Russian aggression against Georgia is both a matter of urgent moral and strategic importance to the United States of America. McCain is chiding the Bush administration to put Secretary of State Condoleezza Rice on the case, saying that she should go to the G8 nations as well as NATO and demand that both organizations get more actively involved. With the McCain campaign in Pennsylvania, Carl Cameron, Fox News Radio.